Alright guys, so here's the deal. I got a request to do Windows 95 destruction, but Windows 95, unfortunately, I failed to get it to work. So, uh, hold on. Let me just go shut the door. So we're going to destroy Windows 98. We're actually using, uh, 98 second edition. So, but, uh, whatever, it's still Windows 98. Virtually no difference except for bug fix fixes. So let's see, where's Windows? There it is. First of all, we need a clever name. One that will, people will really remember us by. <gasps> How about Plums? Everyone likes Plums. Turn the volume up. For the ultimate gaming PC. Whole 16 colors. Ugh. Thank you, you ruined my dramatic reveal. Thank you. Oh, actually, I have to... I'm gonna log out and in again. I forgot to take a snapshot of this. Uh... Ah, I'm a brand new PC. Let's do a stinking snapshot. Alright, uh, I don't need any of this crap. Online services. <sighs> yeah, whatever. Yes, delete it. I don't care if it's a read-only file. I don't care if it's, like, the most important thing in the, in the entire world. Alright, there. Now we have a clean desktop. Internet connection. Yes, I'm sure, because VirtualBox will just make internet work by itself. Do not show it in the future, or whatever. I'm pretty sure that it should be able to load it, but if not, then we'll improvise, and we can still have some fun with this virtual machine. AT&T. Oh, we know how good that that network is. Just what I want. A terrible network in the U.S. No offense. On my computer. Just what I want. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. AOL. What is that? I don't even. I mean, I know what it is. It's like some old internet service. Oh, all right. Uh, Google.ca. I don't know if it'll even load anything right now. Oh, I know I forgot to install games. I forgot in the installation. I forgot I remember the themes, but... I don't- I can't even tell if it's even- if this internet is even working on here. Alright, you know what, let's just create, like, a, a beautiful theme. Properties. Windows Standard. Of course, you know, we always need, uh... Ooh, didn't mean for that. High Contrast. Of course, you know, this is, like, the best template ever, ever created. That'll be the color, and that'll be, like... I don't know the border. That nah, just makes every that just makes the computer look all weird. Sure, whatever. I can't tell if that's Internet Explorer making the noises or Sh scheme. An active window border, make it that color. Active window border.
Oh man, that's beautiful. You know, no. Oh, sorry. I guess we're just gonna do have to do what we did in Windows ME and NT destruction. I guess I'm sorry. Ah, uh, but we can still draw a really ugly picture. Uh, let's do a terrible sketch up of uh John C. Nah, we did that last time. How about uh? Let's draw Keemstar. And I know I'm not a Keemstar fan. No, I need to make this super messy. Uh. Let's draw Keemstar on Windows 98. I'm gonna have such a blast just ruining this computer. You have to admit, you should, it's actually like, I mean, you should. I was at first afraid to do a Windows destruction because I thought vi I was an idiot and I th with virtual machines. And I thought that uh, viruses would like spread to my computer and ruin my life, but. Nope. Alright, we'll draw Keemstar himself. Oh, okay, he looks kind of like a cat chair, but whatever. Uh, I'm. That's terrible. His nose looks weird. <laughs> All right. Uh, I'm gonna try and actually write the word popcorn. Make this like. Alright. Save changes. Sir, sure. Let's save it as. Sure, let's sure, I guess. All right. Oh yeah. Oh, this is so Why does it always want to go in the Windows folder? Isn't it like aren't you like not supposed to save stuff in there? I need to put that down there. Tile. Taskbar is just so nice. No, we need to change, like, this is just so depressing. Let's change our appearance. Let's change, uh... 3D objects. Uh... Other. Let's make, like, a really bad color. Like that, and we'll just make it, like, super bright. Like, salmon, like... Oh, yeah. Okay. Let's see what we can do with this. MS-DOS. Uh, CD, whatever. You know what, I need to log off. Doesn't even remember my name, because it's that... Because Windows 98 is... Oh, yeah. What am I saying? I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. Uh, see if we can just log into some random dude. Uh-oh, don't like that. Whatever. Can log into some random dude. Okay, that- okay, that's nice. Uh, now, I want to show you guys a cool trick. So, you might remember I did a video about this a long time ago, but if you type this into run, then you're pretty much wrecked almost were there for some reason. You cannot escape the blue screen. Or, hey, you actually can. Let's log out and in again. 
We're, I'm, we're gonna... Uh-oh. And when, whenever you actually try and use a function, it usually will freeze up. Windows will usually lock up at this point. So we're just gonna reset it. Oh yeah, I forgot I have the CD in here. Escape. Exit. I don't really care. Let's just get the disc out of there. Yes, our Keemstar background. It's beautiful. Yes, let's play some games. Oh, wait, we can. I didn't put games on here. Dang it. Let's just search to see if there's any MIDI files on this computer. <laughs> I want to see if there's any MIDI files. Look in. Don't be a wimp. Look in this. Look in the whole freaking drive. Find. MP3. MIDI. One file found. Can I see them then? Can I see the file that I found? Help topics. Help looks nice. No, I need I need to get some food. Let's go to McDonald's. I want I want some McDonald's. We'll wait for that to load. Uh don't you just love how big things are? Everything's just covering each other up. Uh, let's. Cr oh, uh oh, we need some documents. Uh, I have an idea. Notepad. Oh, great. Can barely see. Right. Let's see. File. Edit. Set font. 72. The. Save as, uh. We'll save it as. Hmm. Actually, no. No, it. Uh. We'll name it some random gibberish thing. Put it in the desktop. Copy. And of course, I know that I borrowed this idea from someone else, but just press little control V and you got and now it looks like you've downloaded a million programs. Uh, I don't even want my documents. How do you remove it? Uh, is there a recycle bin? Apparently not, it's just glitching out over there. It's just randomly just, ugh, just, just sure, whatever. Alright. What else to, should we do with Windows 98? Let's set the year back to like 1832. Go back. Nineteen eighty. I have an idea. All right, so uh, maximum year you can go up to. I'm pretty sure it's like twenty seventy or something. Alright, let's do it. Make it December 31st, 
$20.99 at, uh, 11, uh, 59.50 p.m. Sure. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve a.m. I, I, it's honestly not going to go past past that date. I don't think. Well, of course, uh, all good things must come to an end. And my awesome Windows 98 virtual machine is no exception. I forget how to do this. I haven't destroyed an operating system, the Windows 9X with the command prompt for a while. I think it's Deltry slash Y C colon backslash. Oh, now I'll go through and break everything, I'm pretty sure. Oh, oh no. Nope. Uh oh, my sounds are dead. Can we log out? Maybe. Oh no, all our awesome documents are gone. That was fast. Start up. Uh-oh. Maybe we need to restart. Maybe it's just glitched. That's always what you do after you destroy a computer. Uh-oh. Do I have a floppy disk in here, maybe? Well, goodbye, Windows 98. You know what? I'll restore your snapshot. I'll be nice. Alright, I will see ya.